You've probably heard the phrase fresh from the garden to your table. The Holman School District takes that saying to heart. It has students growing, planting, and even raising their school lunch. News 8's Kyle Dimke is here with more. At Holman High School, students grow many different things in their gardens, and now they're raising chickens. With the farm to school program in districts all over the area, teachers and students at Holman High School say they began to look at the whole lunch tray and found their plate was missing some locally grown chicken. On today's lunch menu at Holman High School is last night's harvest. Corn on the cob, grown and picked by students. All of our schools have school gardens, uh, and within those gardens we're growing things like uh, potatoes, radishes, uh, some herbs, tomatoes, peppers, uh, pumpkins, squash. Coming soon to the garden menu, chicken. In here right now we have 150. First you start out by um, raking the bedding so all the wet bedding goes to the bottom and the dry comes to the top and then you feed them. After school each day, Holman Junior Gregory O'Laughlin drives about four miles out of town to take care of these chickens. This is the third hatch he and a few classmates are raising to educate students there's more to the meal than what's on their tray. It really gets kids to know where their food comes from and not just it starts out as a chicken breast. So it comes from a chicken, a, from a farmer who put the time in to really grow, raise it from an egg to a chick to your school lunch. We started the program looking at it through our farm to school program and trying to get students involved in producing food for our school lunch program. Teacher and FFA advisor Roger King says the idea to raise chickens came from his students. The other foods they've grown, like today's corn on the cob, have been a big hit with other kids in the district. You guys raised this? I got a lot of that with the sweet corn. Which is why Greg and Chris are excited to see what friends say about their chicken. It was a closer connection. They could talk to you about it, not just, oh yeah, it's good food. It was, you raised this, good job. Now this is not a class for these students. They do this for the school on their own time. The project is funded by the Seeds of Change grant, a $10,000 grant awarded to the Holman District last year. It's one of only 17 schools in the country to receive the grant. All right, thank you, Kyle. The district hopes the students will be able to raise enough chickens to serve every student in the district for one day this January or February.